all about supporting each other. So, cheers. Right, welcome back. So, Hi. Yes. Yes. We passed by 100. Oh, brilliant. So, I've just been told I've now passed my 500 subscriber mark. So, absolutely brilliant. Thanks to everyone that subscribed. Much appreciated. I couldn't do without you lot. So, uh, and uh, yes, uh, there will be a uh, uh, 500 subscriber giveaway. And uh, it won't be a cup. I can tell you that. It'll be something better than that. Uh, I've had it in the head for a while, so uh, that'll be coming up very soon. So, uh, that's it. Uh, we painted the walls. Uh, that side's not too bad. Uh, this, this side of that, that wall uh, is alright. The other side is a bit, a bit dodgy, but uh, so I've put these uh, signs up. I've made myself uh, a flat. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll um, spin it around and show you what I've done. Right, so what I've done is I've took a piece of um, um, treated timber and cut it to, well, right, no, let's start again. So I downloaded the subscribe sign off the internet, uh, printed it on the way, A3 paper, laminated it. I then took a piece of wood to fit it, uh, that's all pressure treated, and I've stuck it all on and uh, drilled it and put it on the wall. And so, if that's a, if I have a thumbs up for that one, a thumbs down, uh, it, it, cost, it cost me absolutely nothing. So, the uh, channel emblem that's going to be going on that wall there. Uh, as I say, yeah, the, wall, the walls have had a second coat and it looks way, way better. It's still drying in, in parts. So that one is going to go in the middle of that wall over there. And they have another couple of pieces to go up. Uh, so I think there's going to be one on this wall here. I don't know whether they should, I don't want to go overboard with it. So maybe the channel emblem on there and maybe one, one over there one there so that's all the walls covered what as I say I don't want to overdo it so uh, that's where we're at so far uh, and once again thanks for everybody that subscribed it's muchly muchly appreciated and uh, totally overwhelmed with that so uh, anyone that hasn't uh, subscribed if you like the content uh, this channel is all about saving money <laughs> And everyone likes to save a bit of money. Uh, gives a thumbs up, thumbs down, uh, like, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much. Okay, so now I have my channel plaque on the right in the middle of that. So it's that. Uh, I think it's about in the middle. So I'll get you the other two done now. Right, so uh, I'm going to uh, I'm gonna pack up now because it's uh, really cold, six degrees, and things are really, really cold. So I'm going to carry on tomorrow. So keep watching. Okay, so now I have my platform, my uh, media channels, Facebook. Uh, Instagram and Twitter so that's that done and that wall there I'll have to take around that to get like a front view so let's have a look there we go come on well you can see that uh, zoom in a little bit Now, uh, is that a, is that a, a thumbs up or a thumbs down? 
Uh, just let me know in the comments. Well, who's a like or dislike? Your choice, people. I think it looks pretty. Uh, pretty good. So this is just done the same way as that, uh, and I thought I'd just do the uh, icons in red, just to uh, go with the black, to stand out a bit more on the wall, so chops are good in. Uh, yeah, so on to the next stage. Right, so that you know, uh, moved it over slightly so it's more central. But uh, I think it's looking alright. Trying to get a view of it all. Now I'm going. So, what do you think, guys? Okay, so I've had a lot of uh, comments of people uh, offering suggestions on the uh, IBC. Uh, so thank you very much for that, guys. And so now it is really getting on my nerves. I just want to get it done. So I've just bought a three-stage dechlorinator. So I need to do that on the next well when it turns up and I've also bought a 12,000 vary pump so that will be the control box for the vary pump will be on, installed there next to the uh, power safe and also um, I don't know where to put the dechlorinator maybe I'm thinking on this wall here uh, so I can run a, the holes along the inside of here and probably put that underground as well I'll put a, uh, a protective inside a probably protective pipe or something like that and that'll run down to the uh, water tap so that's that uh, not done anything uh, yet as of the uh, today so the very pump will be uh, probably sat somewhere around here uh, and there'll be a pipe that goes into the moving bed and that'll come out to that pipe there uh, sorry the um, the uh, UV so uh, and that's probably going to be on full whack so there's going to be from that side of the pond there there's going to be a hell of a hell of a uh, flow rate coming out uh, and hopefully we can get some similar sort of flow rate from the other pump I've got so there'll be uh, a vortex sort of uh, movement in the water which is good for the uh, bottom drain uh, as you can see uh, it's starting to uh, dry out in there now because uh, obviously once that's dry I can get the uh, pond liner and that put in so um, back on my night shift, uh, day shift tomorrow so I'm going to uh, Monday I'm going to uh, sort out all the inside of the wall and I've got the the, um, where are the, the the covers to go over the wall before I put the pond liner in so what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to run a bead of silicone along the wall and just lay the the underlay on top of it and then hopefully 
I'll put some, some some of these over it so it like, sticks down. But I'm just going to go halfway over the wall, so because I'm thinking if I can't get the the capping that I want, I'll have to uh, concrete put a concrete top on of some sort. So so that's where we're at with that. And, uh, and thanks thanks to all the people that um, commented on the um, the 500 subscriber giveaway as well. Much appreciated. Uh, like I say it's uh, like uh, Andy said from uh, Keeping Water, it's, uh, it's a different prize. So it gave, it's gave um, all the people that are subscribed um, that haven't got koi ponds a chance to win something. So it's a good thing that. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. And um, hopefully, what we're on now, it's nearly, nearly the end of January, so I'm saying maybe the end of February I did say the end of February to uh, a couple of guys and uh, hopefully it should be done by then so cheers guys right people I have uh, bought some more goods so let's see what's in the box So we have a J Cod 12,000 Burby pump. It's quite heavy, that. So, um, I don't know what possessed me to buy it, but um, I've got it, and um, I didn't look at the product description and um, <clears throat> it's a submersible one submersible one anyway so uh, as I said it's a, a very pump If I have it sat in the bottom of my IBC, uh, I will have, I have, have the shield, shield on it, stop the uh, cable on getting in. Or I can have it sat outside the uh, IBC uh, with a pipe coming out of here uh, on a 90 going up over into the filler and down and onto another 90 uh, a piece of pipe that long, uh, perforated pipe do it like that. Or let's say just have it sat in the bottom with the shield on and that will connect up straight up back up to the um, return pipe, one of the return pipes. But the problem is, the problem, uh, these are the connectors. Where these connections go with it. Anyway, so this is the problem. Two problems. So, the first problem I wanted to put it on the wall next to my uh, Palisade 5. But as you can see, I had to power pack with it, which is a bit of a problem because obviously that isn't waterproof. And the second problem is the uh, control box. This is a waterproof neither. 
and I actually asked the, 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 that exact question on Amazon um, and uh, sent me a message back saying it's not waterproof. So I've been looking on uh, the internet today and uh, I found um, a, 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 tr um, a, a clear box that sits on a wall. It's basically like a socket box that would fit inside uh, so that would then make it waterproof and obviously I've got these two I'd have to have holes, two holes going through the wall and obviously this whole pack I'd have to get um, one of them um, outside um, waterproof boxes so I'd have to sit in that behind the wall so I'll do that, I'll send it back and get the uh, Evolution Aqua uh, very pump. It's, uh, this cost me 105 quid uh, and the Evolution Aqua 10,000 I think it's 179 pound. Uh, there's a bit of a difference there. Uh, uh, this is but this is a 12,000 and from the reviews are supposed to be pretty good so, so that's that so Monday that will be that will be installed Monday um, and if it doesn't look right Can take it back off and uh, I'll just say I'll send it back. But you don't know. Right, so so that's that. I've also got uh, some uh, I've got some six mil pipe. And I bought these uh, brass um, three-way valve for so basically that goes on to the, the pump, the main pump, and this will split off. So one that side will go off to the um, bottom drain, and this side will come into the bottom of the IBC for the moving bed. And uh, it's solid brassy, so it should be all right. I'll uh, we'll gander that then. So I've got that to do. Uh, this pipe also came with um, these little, uh, like little, I hope, like little. Um, Sprung, spring loaded uh, Jubilee clips. So that, three of them in that. So that's that. Uh, and I've also been trying to find a piece. Uh, um, I've also got a temperature, temperature gauge in the pond at the moment. I want to uh, something digital. And uh, Obviously, when you're shopping online, you can't see the actual size. So, I've got the got a pair of these. I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. So, we have temperature gauges. Uh, uh, they have a little, they have a 1.5 meter wire. I don't know if you can see that. There's a probe on it. Uh, that's how big they are. So I was going to sit that on the wall as well, and these just went off. So that's that. That's another job that will be done on Monday. And I've also got this as well. Right, so here we go. You probably already know what it is. So I'll 
than that everybody's got. Uh, here's, a, here's a clue. There's a spanner. Some fitments. Stickers. Alright. Get it out. Let's get it out. Here we go. Yeah, you guessed it right. Three stairs to coordinator. So that's going to be done on Monday as well. So. There you go. That's that. So, we're busy mon uh, on Monday. And we've also got an IBC coming Monday, so uh, but I think that'll be staying outside because um, I've got to go away to Warrington on Tuesday. So. Right, uh, that'll do. Thanks for watching.